For the past 14 years, Swiss Contact has aided the underserved populations in East Africa, improving their livelihoods through access to finance, with an estimated population growth projected at 300 million by 2050. Financial inclusion remains critical to the socio-economic well-being of these people. Swiss Contact recognizes access to finance as a prerequisite for any successful and sustainable economy. Through its inclusive finance program, commonly referred to as IFP, Swiss Contact has facilitated processes that saw the development of inclusive products and services that were accessible and affordable to all. Swiss Contact implemented different interventions, which aimed to facilitate savings and credit, tailoring their products to the needs of the population, developing the capacity of providers and empowering them with skills to develop viable commercial services that ensure their long-term survival significantly improve the financial literacy of the population, increase capacities in the microfinance sector through the development and implementation of skills curricula in partnership with education institutions, improve access to affordable low-cost housing for the population, promote knowledge and good agricultural practices and improve access to markets for smallholder farmers. IFP rolled out a micro-leasing intervention that sought to give the rural and marginalized urban communities leases against productive assets. Cooperatives continue to play an important role in developing economies by enabling community members to pool together resources and uplift their standards of living. By recognizing the importance of technology in financial management, IFP digitized the Mavuno groups to improve their operational efficiency and accessibility to greater pools of money from formal financial institutions. Lack of proper innovations around food supply management chains leads to huge post-harvest losses. This greatly impacts the smallholder farmers and food security in the region. IFP facilitated the warehouse receipt system which improved the livelihoods of many farmers through access to post-harvest credit. Access to consistent and fair agricultural markets remains a challenge to many smallholder farmers. IFP solved this through contract farming, which involved a fixed-term agreement between a group of farmers and an off-taker. The farmers were trained and certified in good agricultural practices which enabled them to export their produce. The mismatch between microfinance training and the uncatered market needs led IFP to facilitate tailor-made microfinance training that improved product development and service delivery for the underserved. Weak institutional systems limiting cooperative rules and unconvincing processes in microfinance often hinder innovations in product development and quality service delivery to clients. IFP responded to this gap by customizing training sessions for various institutions and their members. Swiss Contact, through its inclusive finance program, relied heavily on building and strengthening solid partnerships to achieve the best possible and most sustainable outcomes. Financial inclusion is critical for equality and remains an important facet in improving livelihoods and creating meaningful opportunities for all.